Well, initially, when we found out last Sunday that classes were canceled, we asked Caleb, what do you want to do? He said he wanted to stay here and hang out with friends. And then it just transitioned into something bigger where we actually have to take him back home. Everything's going to be online and um, it was like a quick and sudden situation. I definitely understand the need for this and I'm very glad like Rice is taking precautions but at the same time you know for me I've it's for a lot of people probably it's you work these three and a half years and this was kind of that semester where you can kind of put your academics to the side a bit um, and you can kind of focus on other things like spending time with your friends you know to not have that same amount of fanfare or the celebration that comes with being a graduating senior. It's a little bit of a struggle. Um, it's kind of sad that a lot of my friends have already left for spring break not even knowing that the semester is going to end. So there are definitely people that I may or may not ever see again. And uh, yeah, that's really hard to process for me right now. People were definitely sad at first and disappointed, I think, really. Um, we kind of all knew it was coming, but when the email actually came out, it was like a little shock wave. And then since then, it's been kind of this like, okay, we gotta do everything now. Let's go, let's go, let's like keep a positive attitude and just like make it happen. We're gonna get congratulations started. So There's a lot of uncertainty about what's going to happen with our commencement address and all of us are moving off campus and we're not sure if everyone's going to be able to come back. So we really just wanted to have a little mock graduation ceremony. Thank you all for coming to our impromptu Wysolation. You know, at least have a celebration here while we still can on campus. And just really make the most out of a really uh, rough situation. Walking through the Sally Port is something you hear about. Um, when you come in, you walk into the Sally Port and you don't walk out until you graduate. So it's really important just like as a Rice student to have that tradition of walking out of the Sally Port together with all the people you walked into the Sally Port with. It seems like the culmination of four years that never really come to completion and like there's levels of grief that we don't get to unpack because uh, things kind of end sooner than you ever think, but these people are amazing and I wasn't even gonna walk through the Sally Port today, but I just felt the energy and I knew that I would regret it if I didn't, and I don't know when there's going to be another time for me to be around so many wonderful people who have each imprinted on me um, and made my rice experience so hard to leave. Like a lot of seniors, I feel like we all just feel like this is not what was supposed to happen. Um, you know, we had a lot of memories we wanted to make, you know, relationships we wanted to foster, and um, honestly this week has felt a little bit like a nightmare, but um, I think it's all up to us to just try to make the best of it. Uh, with the time we have left and um, you know it sounds cliche but this is not a goodbye it's just to see you later.